Hello, this is an example. I'm here in Milkshake City. And you're watching Dynamo TV. So what up, it's Dynamo, Dynamo TV. I'm at Milkshake City, about to meet my boy, Example. There's the man himself. Hello. How you doing, man, you all right? Nice to see you. All good? Cool, man. I'm gonna give um, my camera to, yeah, I'll give this to you. Um, Tio, just name a card. Name, name any card. card. Yeah, name any card. The Eight of Hearts. The Eight of Hearts, yeah? Yeah. Okay, give me a number between 10 and 20. 14. 14. This pack of cards just came out of my pocket, right? I ain't done anything with it. Yeah. yeah. It said the eight of hearts, number 14. Yeah? Deal down from the top. Yeah? Yeah. So, face up, yeah? Um. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Don't turn the point from over yet. You said the eight of hearts and number 14. You could have said any card, you could have said any number. Yeah? <laughs> I literally just walked in, turned over the 14. I don't want to do it. Oh my god. <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> um, you got any change on you? I have. No. That's, that's a good thing. Cool. Tell you what, um, yeah, just. We'll take the two pound and the five p, yeah, mm -hmm. and then we'll put that in your pocket. Yeah, and then let's see. Uh, can you get a bird's eye view of this? Right. So yeah, um, drop the hand. Like, hold this, hold his hand up. Yeah, hold it flat, 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 flat. With this hand, yeah. yeah. Take this hand, yeah. And just put it over top. Yeah. And watch. So the five p and a two pound coin. Yeah. Okay. I know it's cold outside, but I'm going to try and generate some heat. What? Yeah. I don't need to feel anything. You want to touch it? Yeah, yeah, I did. You have a two pound and a five p. Yeah. Lift your hand up, it's cold. Oh. <laughs> what happened? You know it is. Are you serious? Oh, oh my god. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's it. Oh, jeez. <laughs> <laughs> Try one more thing. Because you've been into music for how many years now? Seven or eight. Seven or eight years, okay. And I mean, I used to write songs when I was 11, but they were rubbish. <laughs> Thanks for that. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> Cheers for that. <laughs> Um, and like, obviously you start with rapping, mm -hmm. but then you even, you have to sing all the hooks and all the songs like that. Yeah, I sing everything I write all the melodies and everything, yeah. Alright, all I want you to do is just think of a song that's, you know, that's like, kind of you know, means something to you, you know, something that's, something that, you know, when you think about it, when you hear that song, you know, it's yeah. quite emotional for you, yeah? Alright. Just get one in your mind, yeah? You're not going to get this. Yeah. It's really a scare song. Right. So it's not like a rap song then? No, it's not a rap song, because that's too obvious. It's a song that my dad used to play when I was a kid. Okay. Alright, I don't know if it's painted black. <laughs> Where'd you get that? How'd you get that? How'd you get that? And he just read my mind. That was probably the scariest. I'm sure there's. See, everyone likes to think they know how these things are done. You go, oh, he was quick with his hands. Oh yeah, he's got a, he's got a little midget working for him. You know what I mean? But the the reading the mind thing is is nuts. <laughs> 